Hey everybody, my name is Gadam Welcome back for another video of NHL 20 uh, franchise mode with the, the European team with the Devils, of course. We're continuing this series. Uh, I thought about it. I think I'm not going to do any trades. There's nobody we can go for, really. Uh, it's not any player we can uh, get, really. We tried to get somebody in the last video. Didn't really find anybody. Uh, Ishiar is really doing awesome this year. Uh, 70 points is... Uh, it's helping him out tremendously to play with um, a good prospect alongside of him. I mean, Pritchett, right? He's playing with Pritchett. Pritchett is not having that good of a season compared to last season. He's actually having a worse season point-wise. But he's doing much better plus-minus. So he's growing. Uh, eventually, he'll become a good player. He's underperforming. But I feel like he's doing fine as it is. Every other player are doing okay. My team... It's doing pretty decent. We are right now in a wild card spot for the playoffs, so I'm I'm thinking we can make it to the playoffs. There's a possibility that we can make it this year. Uh, I just not sure, right? It's not guaranteed, but it's a possibility. So let's just start the simulation up two, a uh, four, six, eight, and ten all the way up to the Boston Bruins game. Let's just start the simulation up and. See where this is going to land, uh, where we're going to land and everything. Let's go. We lose our first game. We're, that puts us as how many losses though? One, two, three, four, five losses in a row. I think we won. Yeah, we won this one. There's a loss, but in overtime, so at least we got a point. We got to get as many points as possible. There's a loss in regulation, but a win. Another win. There we go. We're getting much more wins than, uh, mo than uh, previous times. And that's four wins in a row now. That's really good. Five wins in a row. All right. We're going in the streak. So we're finishing off with a five uh, game winning streak, which is really good. It puts us at 37 and 27 uh, and six, which is really good for the record. Seven, two and one other last uh, 10 games, boys. I think I, fi I figured out what we needed. Our team is doing much better. Uh, Isha is having uh, 81 points. He did. When you think about it, he did 11 points in 10 games played uh, in, in the last 10 games. So that's really good. We're at 80 points now. Uh, we have, for now, we have a little bit secured our area as the wildcard spot. I don't think we're going to beat the Washington Capitals. They might do a big push at the end there. But uh, we're doing really good. Uh, our team is doing really good as well. Our team overall. Let me just uh, take a look. So Pritchett. Plus 14, 25, 16. These guys are really, really playing well together. I got to take a look. 53 points for Pritchett. Uh, Bodker, all right, playing a little bit. You got to keep in mind that Bodker played a little bit. Third line, here and there, fourth line, uh, second line, first line. He played all the lines. So you got to keep that in mind. He had a, an incredible season so far. So pretty good season for Bodker. Second line, how it's doing? Uh, could do better. Uh, Frolik is doing really good. Uh, Krejci, not so much. Tatar, though, is doing all right. It's just he's doing just fine. Uh, and uh, Krejci, he could be doing better. He's at minus five. So he's at the limit, really. He's at the limit. So, um, but he, he does have forty nine points. I mean, you know, it's it is what it is. I guess he's at forty nine points. The thing that's not working is because we've got two playmakers going on right now. And that's probably what's hurting us, right? That's what's hurting us big time right now. Uh, we do, I mean, we got a three forward in here. Krejci, we got to keep him there. He's doing really good with his 50 points. I think he just needs to play with maybe another two forward. Maybe we could play him. Because at the top, we could probably play him on the third line. But I don't want to switch anything. We're winning games right now. Uh, as long as we're winning games and not switching anything. And these guys are playing well. Uh, these guys are playing well together. I don't know about Bellamy. Bellamy is having a tough time on the third line. He's uh, minus four. Uh, 19 points. Not too shabby. I would love if he did better. But, you know, it is what it is. And he's actually, he's not a, a playmaker. You see that? He's much more of a, he's a two-way forward. Yeah, he's a two-way forward, so that's interesting. I'm going to have to go switch that out. So we got three three-way forwards in here, which is interesting. All right. And the sniper, uh, Bur uh, Burchisi, 
He's doing good. Yeah. Oh, Cassie, though, is doing horrible. He doesn't like it in the fourth line, huh? Minus 16. Oh, you know what? No, he's been plus one for us. No, he's been plus one. He's playing good. It's actually with uh, the Anaheim Ducks and he's he's been struggling. So we got to look with us. So he's a sniper, playmaker, uh, playmaker as well. They're all they're all just doing fine at the positions they are, uh, I, I guess. I, I do have to switch um, Bellamy though is a thing because apparently he's uh he's not what we thought he was. We thought he was a playmaker. Turns out he's a two-way player. That's much better. Uh, looking for us. Let's continue the simulation here. We did really good for this one. I uh, wasted enough time already. So two, four, six right there, eight and ten all the way up to this game that's gonna put us at 80 games I might as well just simulate the rest of the season while we're on it uh, Ruta got injured so we got one of our defensemen that uh, is injured which is uh, our one of our main goal uh, defensemen as well which is not good at all we gotta switch in for Kuken or Kuken you're getting in there um, all right let's just see uh, who else could play here so I guess I'm gonna pick uh, Zbiza. Zbiza you're gonna play with Mueller uh, we've got uh, who else here? I guess uh, Mazen. There we go. And you can play there. Now defense is going to be struggling a little bit there, but that's fine. We got a loss, a, a win, and an al a loss. Another win. So it's 50 50. Another win. There's two wins. And uh, a loss against the Washington Capitals. That's a huge loss right there because we're in competition with them. But Ruta is back. So we can put Ruta back in here. Let me go ahead and put him, put him back, boys. So, Mazen and Zbiza, right there, just like that. Let's go, boys. Everybody's back in their position. There's a win for us. Uh, a loss. Can we win this game? There, there, there's a win for us and another win. So, two wins in a row now. And that's a huge win against uh, the Capitals, even though it's an overtime, though. I think, um, let's see, did we make it to the playoffs? We did. So, we clinched the playoffs and... Plus we did we did uh, we are tied up with the Capitals right now. We could clinch it to the third position, but at least we made it to the playoffs, so that's good. That's our third year, boys, and I managed with a, a European only team to make it to the playoffs on our third year. So uh, a lot faster than I thought it would be. Forty three wins, uh, six and four the last ten games. Our team is doing incredibly well, boys. Uh, I'm really happy about all of this. So let's just simulate the two, the last two games of the season and uh, go for the playoffs here. Let's go ahead and do it. Hope that we win these two games. No, there's a loss. Uh, we finish up with a two uh, ga game losing streak, which is not good. Not good because we're now in the bad momentum, but I guess it's fine, right? All right. So let's just see where we are right now. Uh, with the points wise for the player individual stats a best score of the uh, of the year was Nico Isha with uh, 30 uh, 39 goals for us so he's our only 30 goal score on almost 40 almost 30 for pro league uh, 29 goals he would probably gotten it if he played on the first line or something uh, best player of the uh, of our team uh, Isha as well 89 points a really good season for him he really uh, it really helped him out tremendously to play with uh, good players this time around i uh, see that last year was minus one because he played with garbage players uh um, i'd say it's kind of the same amount right it's the same type of uh, season as last year except this time around he got a little bit more goals uh, than assists but still pretty much the same right it's uh, definitely the same uh two way forward let me see uh make sure yeah i mean i'm putting him as a two way forward but it's uh, it's 15 17. i'd i'd say he's much more of a, a sniper at this point or even a f yeah i'd say he's even a power forward because he's six foot one yeah i'd put him as a power forward i don't know why i put him uh, uh anyways he's playing good I've uh, got Pritchett ended up with uh, 61 points in his uh, second uh, year as a player. A lot less than last year. Last year he got 80 points. Uh, this year 61 only. 
but it's still pretty good. It's, it's decent. Uh, it's the minimum required for a first line or 60 points, but I don't know, boys. 60 points for uh, Tatado on the second line. Uh, Tatado definitely uh, uh, did really good. Minus five, though. Uh, he struggled to, uh, towards the end there, and uh, Krejci definitely struggled even more. Uh, struggled even more. Uh, minus eleven ended up fifty six points for League Vanek, uh, Casey, all these guys. Uh, Bellamy, we gotta look at him. Minus ten to finish it off. That's a big oof. Entire league. There we go. All right. So that's a lot of points actually. So sixty goals for M uh, Connor McDavid, boys. Fifty five goals for uh, Sagan. And uh, for 54 goals for Salonen, a prospect from Montreal, a medium elite from Montreal. Holy shit. Well, I think they figured out, figured it out. Montreal got their prize, finally their big time player, boys. 54 goals. Holy shit. All right. And uh, for better best player, McDavid, 115 points. How many points did he get last year? Uh, seven? Oh, this guy's, this guy's a beast. How many points did he he got already 695, almost 700 already. This guy's a beast. Sagan, uh, McKinnon, uh, Dry Saddle, Crosby still doing really good. Uh, Yamamoto, Yamamoto really, top six doing 92 points. Okay, Barzell, Ovechkin still has an old age, 36 years of age and still doing really good. Ishiar is, uh, is in there, boys. He's in there. Taylor Hall and all this shit. Uh, Pavel Datsu still doing really good. Uh, goalies, or defensemen, I should say, first. And the best defensemen, Dolly, Thinberg, uh, Carlson, Edmund, Eggman Larson, uh, the other Carlson, Darlene, and uh, Hamilton. The other ones, the goalies. Best goalie would probably go to uh, Tukaras for sure. 44 goal, uh, 44 wins. Uh, 41 wins for both Demko and Renta, and the rest are right there. All right, boys, let's uh, let's go ahead and start the simulation against the Pittsburgh Penguins for our first round. Uh, first time we make it to the playoffs after three years, so let's look where this is going to lead us. I'm hoping very far, but uh, we'll have to see. We're facing off against a, a really good team. Let's read the lines really quick for a view what we're facing up against here. So, Pittsburgh Penguins. It's a it's gonna be everything's gonna be a tough team, but oh boy! All right, here we go. We've got Datsuk with Crosby and Genzo. Holy shit! Uh, Cahoon with Malkin and Galchenyuk. So the second line is all right. Uh, in the 85s, both Galchenyuk maybe the weakling of that line. Uh, Malkin is growing older, getting older a little bit. Tanev, Rust, Ornquist. So this is a, a bad third line right there. I'd say, well, it's not a bad third line. It's in the 80s, but I don't know. It could be better, boys. It could be better. So third line is weak. Fourth line is weak as well. All right. Uh, the the good defense is not that better. It's better than ours. Obviously, we got a horrible defense, but... They, they don't have that much of a defense. It's all uh, offense. And they've got the goalie, of course. They've got Matt Murray. So they do have Ma the goalie and the offense, but the, the top two the line. So the, you got to watch out for the two first lines and the goalie. And that's about it. So let's hope that our goalie is going to do the job here. Uh, first period. Oh, we're winning. Oh, my God. Mueller and Fro League. So we got a defenseman that scores and Fro League scoring for us. Second period. There's another goal for us. Luca Spiza playing, uh, scoring for us. I don't know what Murray is doing, but giving out three goals like that. And third period. Oh, they scored two. So Datsuk, he, uh, Pritchett scores one. Datsuk replies. Pritchett uh, replies as well. And Datsuk replies. It was a battle for the third period. Battle between these two players. Uh, two goals for each of them, but... That's who was the only one who showed up in this game for the Pittsburgh Penguins. That's going to help us out tremendously. Plus 36 uh, shots. Can't look that off. Uh, our goalie uh, really did. Riddich really did a good job here uh, protecting us. Orlando Pritchett on the playoffs, boys. He's actually pretty do uh, really good. He's three points, boys. Three points. That's really good. 
All right, let's jump into the second game. We're winning. All right, we won this first game. Let's uh, jump into the second game right here. First period. Oh, uh, we ended up... Okay, we're losing. Dubinsky scores two goals. Holy shit. Two goals for Dubinsky. That's very, inter very interesting. Second period. All right, we're not scoring. In third period... Uh, it looks like they're going to call it off. All right, so Galchenyuk and McCann is going to finish the job. So they got a shot out on us. That's not good. That's not good. That's not a good game, a good second game here. That's not what we wanted to do, boys. But uh, now we're going home. We're in a home heist right now. 1-1. One 50-50. One. It's pretty uh, decent, right? Let's hope that this time around uh, we get more luck. Maybe for our, from our players or something. Uh, first period, nothing. Uh, we're doubling them down in terms of shots, which is crazy. A uh, second period, oh my god, yeah, we we're doubling them down almost. Uh, so they're they are catching up now. So they're starting to pop up. We gotta do something, boys. Third period. Oh my god, we let them too. Okay, so Ross and Genzel. At the very end of the period, it's going to score one. I mean, Bellamy tried to get us back into the game, but a bit too late there. So we ended up losing this goddamn game. That's that's annoying, boys. That is not good. So, all right. So Bellamy scored one for us, right? I got to look. We're losing two to one right now. I got to look who scored for us. So he's got three points, two points, one point. Uh, one point zero. He's got two points. He's got one point. We're gonna keep it like that. There we go. All right. One point. Uh, Haas, you're going in there. You're you got a point. There we go. You got two points. Vanek and Haas, they're moving up. All right. Chi and whatever. They're key. They're getting there. They're keeping there. Uh, they're playing good. All right. Good. Mueller, all right, so two. Who else got a point here? Hold on. I suppose Bezos. Bezos got a point. There we go. Just like that. All right, I'm putting the, the ones that they do produce here. In exchange for maybe, maybe Ruta, actually. There we go. All right, so let's see if that's going to do the job. And what's the, the goalie did? What did the goalie do? The Richard Rilic is really good for us. He's playing good. So all we need to do is play a little bit better here. Um, here we go on the fourth game, boys. Hopefully something good can happen out of this uh, first period. There's, there it is. There it is, boys. Switching out the lineups a little bit. And we got three goals. Frolik and Mueller scores two goals. Pedersen tried to reply. Uh, but uh, Cassie is going to... And the fourth line at that is going to reply. That's really good for us. So there it is, boys. Second period. All right, that's a little bit too much, though. Oh my God, we're winning three to one. They ended up. Uh, Malkin scores another one. It's three to two at that point. Ruta puts us at four to two, and we let them score two other goals. We let them score three goals. It's basically the other opposite, the opposite thing from the first period. So that's uh, four to four after three, uh, two periods. We're gonna have to go on. Uh, uh, slow simulation, medium simulation right here. Oh my god, we take a penalty. Oof, we kill it off. Let's go. No, another penalty. Oh my goodness. All right, Brendan Auten. All right, he's going to score one. Yeah, that's probably going to be it. Oh no, all right, good. Ah, scores one for us. That's awesome. Five to five, boys. Oh my, Galchenyuk, of course. Oh shit, Malkin. All right, pop it off. Yeah, 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 Dubinsky, yeah. Oh my god, we had a chance. We just five eight goals. We're giving up eight goals, boys. We're not gonna score eight goals. Oh boy, here we go. That's that was that bullshit right there. Now we we just lost three games in a row. Three games unanswered. Oh my goodness, what am I supposed to do here? Last chance, boys, to do something here. Last chance before we get eliminated. I'm not gonna be mad if we get eliminated. But, I mean, we did win a game. We were doing fine. We're scoring goals. We're just giving up too much. We don't have any defense right now. And that's what's hurting us. So, let's go, man. Let's go. You got this. Oh, come on, boys. 
stop taking penalties. That could help us out if you don't take penalties. All right. Uh, come on now. If we're lucky, we'll have a decent penalty kill. Like Christ. How is that happening right now? All right, let's go, boys. Uh, after fir uh, the first period, 20 minutes, there's uh, 10 shots for, so three more shots than us. Let's go to second period. I don't have anything to say, man. New Jersey, you just got to hope. We got a power play right here. Score goal? No, they can't. They can't score a goal. Oh, they score one. All right, Patrick Onvix. And we give them a, pen a power play right away after that. A big one, a long one. Oh my, four minutes probably. Like, what are we doing? Just let them score. And once again, right after they score, we give them a four minute like penalty. It's like, come on, another power play for my... Oh, we're undisciplined as fuck. Holy shit. There's a, there's a power play for us. We can't uh, capitulate, boys. We can't, we can't um, do anything about it. We can't score on the power play. And that's going to do it. Yeah, that's going to do it. Yeah, all right. Shit, that's just going to just score one. I don't know what British was doing right there, but that's just, just going to run easily, and that puts us out. And we're eliminated easily. Uh, we're easily eliminated in five. Well, that's a shame. That's just a shame. We made it to the playoffs. I was happy. We had to go against a goddamn offensive two lines of uh pittsburgh penguins uh, like it's an offensive theme and we don't have any defense that's not good that's really not good boys so toronto and uh, ended up uh winning the game winning the cup so i guess uh good for toronto montreal is gonna have the second and the third round pick oh my god they've got they're gonna get so many good players they also have the 13 overall so Montreal is going to be uh, a beast of a team. Where are we? Uh, the Devils, the Devils, New Jersey. We're not even there. We're not We're not even in the top 15, boys. Oh, that's not good. Well, that is definitely not good if we're not in the top 15. Review the retired players this year. Forwards, we've got Eric Stahl decided to retire. Williams, uh, Gabarek. All right, we've got a couple of players here. Dubinsky. That motherfucker who scored two goals on us. Oh boy, somehow he's playing on the fourth line, boys. But somehow finds a way. A uh, defense. Uh, we got uh, Shara, Fanoff. All right. So these two big players that uh, decide to retire. It's interesting. That's interesting. Uh, Amnus Johnson. A couple of people here, and the uh, goalies. Uh, Michelini, Gustafsson. A bunch of player. Let me just see, devil-wise, for the devils, did we lose anybody, if at all? All right, but we, did we lose anybody? We did. So we uh, lost uh, Belmar and Stride, both were playing the minors, so that's fine. And uh, goalie-wise, did we lose somebody? No, we just lost two minor players. All right, then. We're simulating to the draft pick. Dubinsky became a, um, a scout, I guess, or a coach. So the beast is a coach now in Amnius. And Elba, uh, Ben Ma is going to be a scout for us, but we're not going to use him. All right. Let's go, boys. Uh, continue. We're going to go to the draft class. We're going to see what we got as an option here. So remember, uh, Europeans only on the Western side. Um, for... Um, Poland is basically the uh, the last the last one that we can take. So Poland is the last country is the deadline of the place that we can take, right? So um, Norway will be accepted now. Well, I'm gonna accept Norway. I'm gonna accept uh, Sweden, but Finland is not accepted. So we can take Swedes, boys. We can uh, take the super Swede at this point. I'm gonna accept that, but. Uh, uh, not the the fin uh, uh, Finland uh, is not uh, the super Finns or whatever they're not uh, gonna be eligible. So we've got Backlund in here, but we're not gonna be able to get him. I mean, Backlund could be a really good player. He's a super sweet, but I mean, I'm not gonna be able to get him. He's a bit too far away. We don't know where we are. Uh, I don't know my um, where we are, but uh, we're gonna try to get it. I'm gonna. I'm gonna scout these dudes. I'm gonna scout this dude. So we're gonna. I'm just gonna interview them really quick, boys. Give me a second. 
All right, so I went ahead and did my scouting, boys, uh, for the draft. Uh, let's go ahead and jump into it. I don't know where we are in terms of uh, the draft picks and everything. Let me just see really quick. Montreal is so lucky. We got to pick one of these at least. All the way at 17th. Uh, do we have another one? Uh, Savoie, all right, Gaucher. We got a couple player here, uh, plays here. I don't know where I'm going to be able to pick in the 17th position. Not in the lead, that's for sure, but damn it. Damn it, man. All right, Baikov. We do no. We can't pick him up because he's a little bit too far from us. Uh, we do have uh, this guy, though, right? That's uh, that's Poland, I believe. That's Poland. I'm not sure. I think that's Poland. All right, so that's about it. We can pick uh, this guy up, and we've got Kronval as well. Michael Kronval, A plus. This was one. Of, uh, this guy was on the A plus. Is a plus 15 as well. This is a plus 19. Uh, right wing or left wing, boys? I don't know. We do have uh, Ronaldo in here. Uh, A-plus as well. He's got... Um, how many? 12 points or whatever? 11 points. So 11 points. This guy's got 5 points. And this guy's got 7 points. I think I'm going to go for Ronaldo. I might be tempted to go for Ronaldo, boys. Let me go for him. Ronaldo, it's made him top six. All right, let me just see real quick if I missed out on anybody really. Baikov was um was a top six. Okay, so I didn't miss out on anybody. He was sixty three. This guy sixty four. That's good. Uh, anybody else that I might have missed out? Blojas, uh was a medium top six as well. So I didn't miss out on anybody. I did a, a right pick, I guess. Let's see what we got. So. Wickinson, Enriksen. Um, we got these options right here. So all these guys are good. All these guys, we can pick them up. Uh, these four guys. One of these four guys is going to be the one. So A plus, A plus, A in this B. This is B. So one of these three guys that we're going to pick them up. Uh, three points, 33 games. Uh, two points. He's got uh, no points. They're all uh, wingers. Uh, yeah, they're... they're they're all uh, Fords, so McLean. Which one would be the best option, boys? I don't know. Let me check that out really quick. All right, these two are basically the same, right? Yeah, these two. Uh, I'm not going to pick Enrikson, but these two are basically the same players. One is 17 years of age. The other one is 18. So I'm going to pick McLean in here. Same country once again. Low top six. Let's go, boys. Let's see if we miss out on anybody. A medium uh, starter right there. Wilkinson medium top nine, so uh, worse. Enriksen is worse, so that's good. Right, either good choice and uh, low top six. All right, I don't think I missed out on anybody. I didn't make any mistakes so far uh, uh, while choosing my players. So, so far so good. What about? Okay, so we do have two players in here: Mueller or Dubinsky. You just see right there. All right, so there's the option right there. So one, two, three. Uh, that's Finland, so just four, I guess. We got four options here. Dubinsky, Mueller, another Mueller. Uh, B, uh, B, uh, B League, B minus. Uh, that's a B League as well, so forget about Dubinsky for now. And this is an A plus. We're picking him up. He's an A plus. We're picking him up. Medium top nine, 49 overall only, boys, but we don't have a choice. We're going to pick him up, boys. Uh, Jakobsen, A plus. Uh, and we've got this guy. He's an A plus as well. Two demons. Uh, this guy A plus as well. Okay. So which one do I want? Uh, the defensemen's or so one? I don't know. Okay. So this guy, I would pick up this guy, right? Actually, I would pick up this guy, Jakobsen, and with four. I think I'm going to pick up uh, Jakobsen. There we go. Pick up uh, Jakobsen. Uh, low top seven. Whatever. Right. We didn't make a bad choice so far, but we're not picking up the players that we want. Uh, I guess I could pick up this guy. He's a B minus, though. B minus. What about this guy? B. A B league for the goalies. Might as well have a goalie, right? We needed a prospect goalie for future. So, medium backup. Not the end of the world. Uh, not the best, but. It's not the worst either. Uh, let me just see. We've got uh, right here, Super Sweet. 
A League plus three. I'll pick him up, boys. Twenty years of age, though. Minor uh, bottom six, so that's a that's a garbage one. That's a garbage. I shouldn't have picked him up. He's twenty years of age. Uh, Landeskog, nineteen years of age. I'm not picking him up. Uh, Fickle, eighteen years of age. Another goalie, pretty garbage though. What about him? Uh, eighteen years of age as well. B League minus one. Nope. Uh, eight on the B League. I'm looking for someone I could have. Ah, shit. No, he's 19 years of age. Bush? No, 20 years of age. Uh, Gerber's 18. All right, we're going to pick a Gerber, I guess. A bottom six. We're not picking up. We're not picking anybody right now that uh, we wanted. So, nothing too interesting. No elites this year, boys, for us. Uh, no elites at all. We're just gonna have to uh, figure this all out, really. I don't, I don't know, boys. I don't know how this is all gonna end. I hope it's gonna end good, but all right. Let me just go to the contracts and sign a few players. All right, boys. Here we go. I went ahead and did all the contracts. Some people looks like are gonna reject. So there's somebody that uh, I did see somebody that rejected my contract. Let me just see real quick who is it. Who is it that rejected? Was uh, Tobias Reader, a left winger. All right, uh, left winger, a reader. Why don't you want to come back? So, what's the whole story here? He had 35 points. He doesn't want to play in the minors, I guess. Uh, but you're going to have to play in the minors, buddy. Uh, well, you know what? He's on the two-way deal. Uh, I could probably find someone better then. Could probably find someone better. So, let me just do uh, two. There we go. Tobias Reader doesn't want to come back. That's fine by me, boys. Let's go. Anybody else that needed sign in? No. Nope. All right. So let's send to the free agency. Finally, look at what we need. Uh, hire the coaches. Let me just see. Uh, uh, I need a goalie, right? A, a coaching goalie. The, you know what? The, the AI can deal with that. That's the AI's problem. The staff doesn't matter. Let's go. Uh, yeah, whatever. Let's go to the free agency, boys, and finally choose our new players. So we got some big names in here this year. Holy shit, look at that. Uh, we got McAvoy, but McAvoy is an RFA, so uh, we only want UFAs, but we do have Barkov in here. Holy shit. A lot of big players. So we need one snipe, uh, one center. Let's uh, take a look, boys. Barkov is a... F oh, he's from Finland. Oh my goodness, boys. Barkov is from Finland. That's the uh, the line. I said I wasn't going to pick up the people from Finland. Oh, boy. Well, looks like I'm not getting this guy. I could have gotten him, boys, but I'm not. All right, then. Paul Stashny. Nope. Uh, who, anybody else, really? Yo, tell me. Tell me Thornton's still playing at 42 years of age. That's just crazy, boys. Oh, we got someone. Walmart right here. Walmart. Uh, we got other people as well. Uh, they're all uh, from Finland. But there's Soderberg. So we can either pick up Soderberg or Walmart, boys. Which one should we pick? Uh, he's got 85 awareness. And he's got 83. I'm going to pick uh, Soderberg. He's much better. Much better. And uh, yeah, I'm going to pick him up. Nobody wants him. Let's just get him for the two years he wants. And two point... Uh, one seven seven five and there it is. There's the the center we needed, boys. Left winger, we need two left wingers. Let me just see real quick. So let's try to find. Oh, we get, we have somebody, Cahoon, right here. Yeah, eighty three years of age. We're gonna pick him up right there. He was playing for um, I believe for for the uh, Pittsburgh Penguins, right? So let's pick him up. Somebody else wants him though, so we're gonna have to give him the. The five mil, boys. We gotta have to give him the five mil. All right, that's a big contract for him. Uh, anybody else? Let's see. So we got a super sweet right there, Jan Mark. We could pick him up. Let me just see real quick. He's in the 80, 81. Patrice Marlowe, nope. So it looks like he's the only uh, good option for us right now. Yeah, all right. He's 84 of awareness. Fine, why not, right? So. Let's spin uh, yarn mark. Make sure that he goes with us. So 2.8575. Uh, Let's go. So we got him. 
Right, we got our two left wingers. We need a one right winger. Let me just see. We can pick uh, somebody. Martin Furk could be a good one. Could be a good one. Uh, let me just see. Anybody else? We do have Bjorkstrand as well. So we can always pick Bjorkstrand, I guess. Nope, nobody here. Uh, Yarn Croc is uh, in the 80s as well. Uh, let me just see. Anybody else? Nope. Oh, yes, for fast. All right, yes, for fast as well. Oh, no, okay, so yes, for fast, yarn crock. Let me just see which one is better 84, 86. Okay, 86 for yarn crock right here. The other ones was uh, Bjorkstrand, so 86 as well, and 88 for uh, Martin Furk. We're picking him up, picking Martin Furk, boys. He's gonna, somebody else wants him. I only want him for two years, so. Two years, five million for you, buddy. All right, two years at five million. Let's see what you can do for us, buddy. Let's go. All right, we got that. And we need two demons now. Oh, this is going to be hard. There's no demons available, really. All right, that could be interesting for us. There is this guy, uh, Michael Campney. So, yeah, we're, we'll pick him up, right? 83. He's uh, at least two, two more. Yeah, sure, why not? He wants a three-year deal, four-year deal for you. Uh, there's a lot of people I want him, so 4.125 uh, for him. Let's, let's go, Michael Campney. We need uh, one more, uh, one more uh, defenseman right here, boys. All right, let's take a look, boys. Let's see. We're gonna find him pretty quick, I'm, I'm guessing, because there's a lot of super sweets. So, Borgman, the Strongman as well. Uh, there's got to be somebody else. Nope. All right. So Strongman or Borgman, which one do we pick? He's uh, 84. He's 85. Strongman all the way. Picking him up, uh, Strongman. Uh, he wants he one year. We're going to get you five years, boy, uh, buddy. Uh, 2.6, all right? 2.6, five years. You're staying with us for the rest of your career. All right. Uh, goalies do we have anybody really for goalies not that i need any but never know grabar or oh, could be a really good defense uh, go a goalie for us grabar yeah i think i'm gonna pick him up yeah we need uh we need somebody like him so make sure that he he does stay with us five years uh for 5.7 let's go boys five year 5.7 i want that goalie i want grabar would be really uh, important to have him. He's gonna, he would help us out tremendously. All right, let's advance the days until the fourth. Usually that's when they decide. There you go. Oh, there's a big trade. First runner. All right, traded to Colorado. We do have Grabar. He's gonna be our new starter, go boys. That's good. Uh, Janmark, Strollman, Soderberg, and Cahoon and Campney, Furk as well. They all accepted. They're all in our team now. Uh, that's that's really good now that we all uh, have we have all these players really we're good to go boys we're good to go we can simulate until the actual uh, season i'm going to do that myself uh, look at the rosters and everything edit the line so i'll see you guys for the next video remember to leave the like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video keep it easy